unfortunately, it has. Recently, social influencer Ricardo Godoy tragically passed away while getting a full body tattoo under anesthesia. He went into the procedure thinking he'd be asleep, blissfully unaware of the risks involved. But even with medical supervision, things went wrong. And now, the trend of mixing tattoos and anesthesia is raising a lot of red flags, even amongst tattoo artists themselves. And believe it or not, Ricardo is not the only one to have passed away in this manner. Now, I have very mixed feelings about this as a tattoo artist. I would be very sketched out about the person that's going under anesthesia, having some type of complication and possibly dying. Just the whole medical aspect of it, of the person going under, that would totally freak me out. As more people opt for general anesthesia to endure the pain of body art, the risks grow, especially as this trend shifts outside of medical settings. So when you weigh the pain of a tattoo against the potential dangers of anesthesia, is it really worth it?